Hey guys, hope you're doing well. We're just going to jump right into this tutorial. And yeah, the first thing that you want to do is make sure your face is completely clean. I didn't film this part, but you can just use soap or whatever you want. Then take your olive oil. I'm going to use this one. And I'm just going to put this on my face. Take a healthy amount, like you should be shining after this step. Just because, I don't know, you just want to be well moisturized. The next thing I'm going to take is the Even and Matte by Garnier. This is for oily skin to just prevent sweat and stuff. And we're also just going to be using this primer at a point. Uh, so, step one, moisturize. You can see my face is very shiny. Now we're putting the Even and Matte Garnier to prevent sweat. And it also like kind of like, I don't know, it makes your skin look so just good. Look, just look at that guy. Just look. I don't know if you think it looks good, but... <laughs> I think it does. Um, so the next thing we're just going to use is the Kiss Beauty Primer. And we're also just going to... Okay, I'm going to put this on my eye. Just because we want to prep for this eyeshadow and some went into my eye. But I was trying to play it cool. Um, that's just to prep your eye for the eyeshadow that you're going to put. The next thing you're going to do to prep your eye is get some concealer. I'm using the Elega Pro Concealer in Warm Honey. And yeah, you just want to take it and, I don't know, you don't really have to get a certain shape. Just like apply it on the whole eye. And then you want to set it with a setting powder. I just got this one because it's super affordable. And yeah, here, top off the excess, guys. Trust me. So this is how it kind of looks. And look, look what happens when you don't top off the excess. It looks like <laughs> my eye is burning. So the next thing you want to do is also set just the other eye. I'm just think I'm just going to set the other eye. This was better, you guys. I tapped off the excess. And then, now our eye is fully primed. We're going to take my Weekend BH Cosmetics Weekend Festival Palette. It is beautiful. Just guys, just look at this. The design is beautiful. And we're going to take the color Hipster. <laughs> just take the color Hipster or any like brownish color in any palette that you have. Tap off the excess so that it doesn't. If you've done your makeup already, don't want it to go on it and um, I'm just going to take it in windshield wiper movements and also like circular movements on the cornea of your eye which is just between your like the bone on your upper eye just in between there where there's a fold take it there with like windshield wiper movements and circular movements to blend you want to blend this in have you guys watched the movie blended yeah it should be blended so it was so irrelevant so uh, you want to clean this up as you go. The next thing you want to take, I took this shiny kind of pink shade from the same palette. I don't remember what it's called, something like boho, but you'll just see it. It's very conspicuous. And I just want to tap this with my finger and then go in and blend this. Because you want drama, but not too much drama. We just want to, you know, you want to pop, but you want it to be easy. You don't want to struggle doing your makeup for like an hour. This takes literally like five minutes, guys. So the next thing that we're going to do is we're going to highlight under our eyes. Here I was not really trying to cover my eye bags. I was trying to go for that like natural look like you know I have eye bags guys. You know that I do not sleep. You know that sleep is a foreign concept. So I'm just going to brighten the under like my under eyes and the bridge of my nose. Even though this is very dangerous because I have a huge nose. I used to get those jokes for like Timina um, is your hand cash here? Yeah handkerchief a sheet or something because you know when you have a big nose you you've had a lot of these jokes just um highlight also your maybe your chin and the top of your forehead over there and then oh here i was listening to some music i wanted to show you guys uh, i don't know why i'm oversharing next thing i'm going to do after highlighting those parts of our faces is contouring and I just wanted these steps not to follow each other so that you can see how to highlight then contour. So for my contour, I know I look crazy. <laughs> I use my contour and scalp palette by Beauty Treat and I just contour. You see, the reason my nose is so heavily contoured is because we're trying to get it to look kind of like a bet not a better shape. I like the shape of my nose, but like I don't know how to explain. Like to make it look sharper, I, I guess. So, um, also, I have a round face, so I go on the corner of my cheeks, and here I'm just showing you how to blend. You want to blend this in like well because otherwise, it's just going to look like you have a dark line and um, like going down from your cheek. And if you can't get a contour and sculpt palette, just get a concealer shade that's darker than your skin. Now, we're going in with foundation, 
this is the Maybelline one. It is bomb, guys. I swear, okay, I know you're spending 1,400, but but you can use it for a long while and you don't use it every day and it's so, it's so bomb. My color is T56 and I feel like it's the perfect color. This, I'm telling you guys, you will not regret buying this one. It's so amazing. So here I'm just showing you how to blend what we had earlier. Um, at home. <laughs> Um, highlighted and we're just going to blend Ble like <laughs> I cannot emphasize this enough blending is key I'm just using the same setting powder guys you see I'm just using the same product so that you don't have to buy like a uh, hundred products for this look and then I'm just going to do my eyebrows you guys doing your eyebrows on camera is the hardest thing I was trying to use the viewfinder to do them and I had the hardest time I just had to like switch up the camera do them in the mirror and then come back look look at what i was doing like what is that um r.i.p those eyebrows but later they came back they bounced back guys the fufuka and yeah i love the shape of them just get a shape that you like and then you're going to just clean it up with the same concealer the maybelline one i mean what the illegal one and till you get the shape that you like next thing i don't like lipstick as such so i use the second love Pout plumping lip gloss in the shade number three called Coralina. I don't know, I just like lip gloss more, and I'm, I have been wanting the Fenty gloss bomb like wish list, guys. Um, for lipsticks, you can get them at Best Lady, don't go to Super Cosmetics because they're the hella expensive. And yeah, the next thing we want to achieve is that healthy glow, and I'm just giving you the same palette, the contour and sculpt one from Beauty Treats, and it's supposed to be blinding. Look, wait, wait, look, look, look at that! Wow, <laughs> this thing is so beautiful, and it's like shimmery, and yeah, it just makes you look healthy and glowy, and yeah, thanks for watching. Hi guys, Demina here and if you're new here, I'm so glad to have you back and this is the first episode of my series, um, Be Your Budget, which just means beauty on a budget. Here we're going to be talking about skincare, makeup, hair and hair care and um, that's what we're really going to be focusing on. Uh, I'm really sorry for the boys who are part of the tea farm because this content won't be as relatable <laughs> but I'm going to start a series that's going to be quite relatable for you guys, two series actually. So there's only one series that won't be as relatable and it's be your budget. Um, I really hope you enjoyed the creation of this look. It was my first tutorial and I was actually so nervous to make this but I hope you enjoyed um, the finished look. I actually like the finished look. Um, if you have any questions you can hit me up. Let me like, go higher so that I don't look naked. Um, what did I want to say? Oh, subscribe to join our small family and I'm so sorry, this might look like I'm so ungrateful but I didn't thank you guys for a thousand subscribers. That might be like a small fit for other people but for me it's a really big fit that we are more than a thousand in our family. Subscribe to join our family and um, click post notifications if you want more videos on this and just for more organization I'll make playlists for each series so that you guys know what to click when you want to see a certain video if you have any kind of makeup videos that you would like to see please don't hesitate to tell me and thank you so much for watching this video it means a lot to me please support me by um, clicking post notifications to and liking this video and sharing this video to as many friends as you can and um, this makeup look okay this channel is mainly for college and university students because we are on a tight budget and we can't really get like we can't be fenting out here so we have to find like makeup tubes to make us so if you can still look good you know we can still be thriving because I know you guys want to look good I know you guys want to look like you're thriving you're glowing you want to look healthy like this particular look and yeah thank you so much for watching I'll see you guys in the next episode or on just another series bye